I don't think I need to explain what this video is about. But what I will say is this. That Marty William Edward Boy Death by Design National Mafia Michael Hacking Southern Harlot and everyone else that has painted me in this awful, terrible light. I hope you guys are happy with yourselves. You know, because of you guys, I've hit rock bottom for the last eight years. Because of you guys, when I had loved ones in the past, whether they were in the military, whether they had health issues, no matter what their situation for their passing was, not once did I ever get to mourn the loss of my friends and my loved ones. At least not while I was around you guys. See, the reason I've been distancing myself from YouTube and the reason why I'm so scared to come back is because I know what awaits me. Which is why I'm not coming back. Because I know very well that unless I bring every one of you down, which is my intent, I intend to make every one of you suffer the way that you've made me suffer. I intend to starve you of all the content that I can. The only reason why I don't come back is because I know the minute that I do it, I'm going to be met with negative bullshit. And to all my real fans out there that have one, been wondering why I left YouTube, now you guys know why. It's because of these fucking evil people that have painted me out as to be the villain for the last eight to nine years. And you know, Marty, I figured you of all people would have had some sort of sympathy for me. Especially that night when I reached out to try to do an intervention for Tibbs, who I saw, who I saw as a brother, who I saw as my little brother. And yes, Tibbs, I understand that you're older than me, but you have the mind of a fucking child. Sorry, but that's just what it is. But you know, Marty, I thought you changed. But I was wrong. I was very wrong. You know, I always often get asked why I don't trust anyone. It's people like you, Marty. People like you that tear me down. Make fun of me for no reason. Take everything I've worked my ass off for away from me. And crumple it up and throw it away. And then what do you do? You make sure that I can't get the fuck back up. By falsely mass reporting my shit, N-word boy. By falsely mass reporting me. By 
pretending to be my representative when you're not. You guys do all this shit for views and clicks. And it's fucking retarded. You know, I've stood by what I've always said. And I will continue to stand by what I have always said. Which is this. That if you guys died tomorrow. Or if you all died today. I would not mourn your death or your loss. I would not mourn the fact that you guys have died. Not one of you would I feel bad for. Because what you guys do is pure fucking evil. Um, you guys have no idea how hard I am fighting to keep my emotions in check right now. Just thinking about everything that you guys have done to me. All the lies that you spewed about me. The fucked up shit that you targeted me for. The shit that you tricked me into. Is ridiculous. You know, I worked my ass off for years. Since 2009, I've worked my ass off. And little did I know that that success would come last year in the form of a silver play button. But let me tell you something. The one thing that I hate above all else is the fact that I have all the awards in the world to show that I've busted my ass. But yet I have no profit to show for it. I have nothing to show for it. Why? Because you guys claim that I'm something that I'm fucking not. And why do you guys do that? Not because you believe it. No. That's not it at all. It's because you guys get a laugh out of other people's suffering. That's exactly what it is. You guys get a rise and a joy and a kick out of seeing other people fucking suffer. And I can honestly say, I hate the term low cow. I refuse to admit to that. Because I know I'm not that. And you might ask, why do you hate the term low cow? Because when you call someone a low cow, you're basically saying that all they're good for is a laugh and that's it. You're basically telling that person that they're not good at anything in life. You're basically telling that person... Hey, you fucking suck at everything you fucking do. You're fucking garbage. All you're good for is a fucking laugh. And that's all you will ever be good for. But yet, you guys don't know me like you fucking think. You really don't. You guys have never seen the business smart side of me. You guys have never seen the calm, collected, content creator side of me. Because you guys don't want to see that side of me. And you know what's funny? Y'all always talk about, well, why don't you do anything? You guys are the reason. Oh, why don't you get a regular job? You guys are the fucking reason. Oh, well, well, well why don't you... Do something else. Because I don't want to do anything else in my life. I want to be a content creator. I want to be a musician and a content creator. I want to help people through my fucking music. 
and share my life story and what the fuck I've been through in hopes that maybe one day just maybe one day that that one person that feels like they're at the end of their life that feels like they can't go on any further will turn my song on And realize that they're not alone in this world. And that there are people out there that care about them. And that there's someone out there like me that truly gives a shit. I want to be that content creator that, you know, people can come in and have a good laugh and have fun. You know, sit down. You know, watch me do some gameplay. Have some fun. I want to be that guy that releases merchandise and releases his own clothing line and is able to show the world what I'm really able to do. I want to be able to build a clothing brand that I can be proud of. That when somebody wears that shirt or they wear those pants or they wear that hoodie or they wear that hat they know that they're part of something bigger than themselves. They're part of a fucking family. They're part of a movement. That's what I want for myself. That's what I want for my future. And I will continue to fight for it no matter what. I want to be that content creator that is able to have all these amazing sponsors and have fun doing what he loves knowing that my family is taken care of knowing that my family never has to worry knowing that my family never has to worry about bills ever again knowing that my family don't have to pay bills ever again That's what I want for myself and for my family. I want my family to be able to live comfortably for the rest of their lives. I want my family to know that when they pass away, they don't have to worry about me making a living because I'll have shit set. And I won't have to worry. So I say this right now to every single troll out there. Your content on me is done as of the upload of this video. You will not get any more content off me no matter what. No matter what you do, no matter what you try to do, you will not receive content from me ever again. And if you do somehow get your hands on content, well guess what? I'm going to be reporting the fuck out of you. And whenever you go to try to do your counterclaim, I'll make sure you're not able to. Because I'm going to be letting that platform know that, hey, these guys are doing this counterclaim in a false way. They are falsely counterclaiming. Because they are liars. So make no mistake, N-word boy. I'm coming for you, and I'm coming for every troll, Marty, Mash Troll, Bitch Face Mafia, Southern Harlot, Death by Design, Bishop Wyatt, every single one of you I'm coming for, every single one of you, and I'm not playing. I am done being taken advantage of. I'm tired of it. And I will no longer sit by and let this go on. That's not going to happen. From now on, 
if I see any content of me out there, I'm reporting you. And I'm shutting you down. Because I have the manpower to do it. And it just won't be me reporting you either. It'll be everybody that I know reporting you. And trust me when I say, in due time, I am going to take my shit back. And, and you guys are going to get legally fucked by me. But here's the thing. You don't know when that's going to be. It can be today. It can be tomorrow. It can be a month from now. A week from now. A year from now. You don't know. But I can guarantee you this. It is going to happen. So, be ready for that. And with that being said, fuck all you motherfuckers that have ever stabbed me in the back. Fuck every single one of you that has ever taken advantage. You're nothing more than garbage to me. So fuck all of you.